We are at the character select screen. Let's see who our fighters choose. Our fighters have selected their characters and they're ready for business. We are about to see a mirror match go down, where they can match each other move for move. This is the hardest kind of match. Who will come out on top? Here we go. What are these fighters going to do? It's the start of the round. How will they start their approach? They gotta escape from the corner before the pressure builds up. Side switch. Now they're on the defensive does not want to get stuck in the corner. Player one will be in a world of hurt if their drive gauge runs out. Uncomfortable space here. Can they clip each other on the edge? Player one with the life lead. Can they exploit this advantage? Both players have near empty super art gauges. Whoever can build theirs up first may have a big advantage here. All right. We're at the halfway point of the round, and both fighters should be well past the warm-up phase. How will both competitors do this for me in time? Player 2 creates a good corner opportunity. Keeping them in the corner will only produce more damage opportunity. Overhead! Gets the jump in. Projectile to try and change the situation. Player 2 is almost dead, but some clutch drive moves and a few prayers could turn this around in their favor. Only 20 more seconds. What's it gonna be? Throws him. What's next? They got it. It's a big gamble and rips out a raw super. They're going for the super art? The quick breather. Player 1 drops him to half, closing the gap. They need to rely on their instincts here. Serenity Stream? Hey, oh. Player two will be able to concentrate a little better with the first round in the bag. Round two. Fight. Ooh, it looks like they're waiting to see what the opponent wants to do first. Burnout is triggered. It's the start of the round. How will they start their approach? Player one in that dangerous burnout state. They need to hold out. Player one has used up all of their drive gauge. Both fighters are looking for a way to fill up their super art gauge. I want to see how they manage their SA gauge here. Player 2 pushes the opponent into the corner. Both fighters are sitting on a full drive gauge. This might be prime time to let it rip. Overdrive arts give moves a big power boost at the cost of using some of the drive gauge. For meter management is vital. It's a big gamble and rips out a raw super. Anticipated that counter and blocks. Very solid corner switch. Player 1 doesn't have a lot of drive gauge to play with. Not a good thing. We have one player in burnout state, which means they'll have to continue the fight temporarily without using any drive reliant moves. With the life gap opening up, they need to lean hard on their drive gauge. Takes a trip. Heading into the end game now, it's getting tense. Goes for a projectile to try and change the pace. They break things off to take a quick breather. Player 2 creates a good corner opportunity. Hmm, taking stock. There's only 20 seconds remaining. All right, what's coming up next? Player 2 can't afford to get hit again, but still has a chance to take the round if they can find openings to use Santa Bar on the Pro Pro Connection does big damage. Serenity Stream? Player 2 holding on to that corner advantage. Okay, oh. It's tied at one to one. Will we see our fighters kick it into high gear? Round three. Fight. Looks like they want to establish a rhythm with their ground game and fireball. Earlier we saw a nice comeback with some very tough mental fortitude on display. You know the opponent isn't going to forget that. The drive gauge is completely empty, meaning their ability takes a big gamble and rips out a raw super. Player one has used up all of their drive gauge. Can they outlast it? They break things off to take a quick breather. 
fighters take a step back to reassess. Time for a new game plan. Goes for the super arc? All right, what's coming up next? This is a real back and forth match. Will this super arc connect? Uses the gauge. Can this super arc set things into motion? There's space to make something happen here, and neither fighter looks willing to back down. With the life gap opening up, they need to lean hard on their drive music. This is the perfect range to reach out and tag them with something. Letting off a projectile to waste time. Reaches out with a lightning kick, experiencing burnout. All right, what's coming up next? Player one in trouble with no drive. Serenity stream? There's a change of size. That's a big gap. Who's going to close it? 20 seconds left. What are they both plotting? Not much time left in this round. Are we going to see both fighters use their drive moves here? Ugh, just go for it at this range. Straight forward with the drive rush. Both of them are low on health and are playing very cautiously. Okay, oh. Player one is one win away from winning this fight. Can they hang on? Round four. Who's going to start things off? Burns the drive gauge. Early round decisions are so important to set the tone. Goes into the stance. Jump. Drive gauge management here is going to be vital. It'll be interesting to see how both players utilize their drive gauge to dictate the terms of the match. Oh, they were looking for that overhead. Ugh, just go for it at this range. A quick breather. Player one is working with a better gauge. What can they do with it? What separates the good from the great in this game is smart gauge management. Oh, they're in the corner now. No running away. Show the medium kick. This is the ideal range to utilize the fireball game. Goes into the stance. Player two has the chance to win the round if they can put their drive to good use. Noticeable life lead. Is a comeback still possible? Time to reassess the situation. Changes the pace with a fireball. Gets it the perfect fireball range. Player two will look to apply pressure here. Good decision with that throw. What now? Oh my god, what's gonna happen? Goes for the fireball, which is very strong at this range. They're running out of control, giving it some real damage. Almost out of time. Here comes the corner pressure. Nice fireball. Backs off. Full drive on deck. Harry connects. The round ends as they do an amazing job protecting the life lead. The fighters have masked each other blow for blow. This fight will be decided in this final round. Who turns out? Close range for the... They're going for the super arc? Uses the game for the super. They're not turning around here. Can they make the most of this? Player one is in burnout state. A very precarious situation. This is where we can expect some major pressure. Out of drive gauge. Now is the time. All the throw connects. Player two can't let this simmer. They got it not going anywhere. Turns out. This is such a tough situation to be in. But they still have a chance. Noticeable life lead is a comeback so far. Yo, Rock Super here? What now? Tuck the fireballs to continue their hold over their zone. Player one can't use any drive boost. Gotta play it safe. They're in oh, block win. Oh my god, block super. No super on offset. No life left. Hazarchi. Are you serious? That comeback was unreal. We just saw this fighter play out of their goddamn mind there. Player one was definitely sweaty during that well-earned win.